Thank you so much for clicking on this video, guys. Uh, I'm really thankful for all the subscribers I have so far. Uh, obviously, for the video, as you guys can see, it's senior night and uh, my class 2019. So I kind of want to go and cheer on for it. Kind of got all my gear with me right now today. And uh, let's get started with this video. I almost got kicked out. All right, 2019 senior night, game day. Let's get it. It's cold. I'm actually going to be trying cheering as much as I can because uh, we don't have any team spirit. So you're going to see a lot of good footage today. Yeah, about the good footage. Um, I kind of look like a creep, kind of recording people. And uh, I, I didn't record much. 42 hits in the And number 52, Sierra Ibarra. I can't tell, I'm a, I'm a tall guy, you know, from all the kids. I don't know if you can tell, I'm the guy in the black shirt. At guard for the Greyhounds, <laughs> 4 Jr. Number 10, on the Raya Laurier! And now it's a 5'8 senior. Number 21, Karina Fahano! At guard for the Greyhounds, 5'4 senior. Number 30, Michelle. At guard for the Greyhounds, a 5'5 five five freshman, number 41, Alani Maniche, number 32, Sydney Pixley. Okay, real quick, what I wanted to do is I wanted to jump up and high five Bailey. And uh, she's a really tall girl, so I expected her to jump or something, like really high. So I kind of just jumped up and uh, this happened. And forward, Bruh. a 5'11 junior. <laughs> Can you see it? Yeah. As you can tell, Bailey was bringing her A game on, and I wasn't. That's kind of why I kind of got slapped really hard. Yeah. Oh, no. Favorite band. Uh, I didn't record much of the band members because uh, I didn't really know much of the band members. I mean, they're a little too cool for me. So <coughs> I recorded my friend George, and they kind of messed up his his last name there. But it's okay, you know. It's all right. Emory was going to the Lilac Parade. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, George Nara. What? 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 Let's you Woo! Let's go, George! Yeah. Woo! Let's 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 you pronounce her last name, but yeah, let's go. George Nara. Oh, you can't see him. Why do you keep pronouncing her last name wrong? The final senior we would like. Yeah, I was trying to call Mario down after this clip because he was about to throw hands because <laughs> he messed up his uh, his last name. So. <laughs> Um, this is the only clip I got of the girl of like me recording the girls' game. Um, kind of didn't want to. Kind of looked like that creep, just like filming girls play basketball. <laughs> so like, I ended up just sitting down and just uh, recording Pablo. What did you just get, Pablo? David, stop. Oh, okay. You need some help. I like how you just asked for chips and then you just got them. Andale! <laughs> Dude, I was like... <laughs> and then the girls kind of won that game. Obviously, come on. And, uh, the boys. Game started. Look at them! Look at them, Look at them working the bench! Should I, should I go over there and sit between them? If you're down, go. I'm gonna hit on you. Go, 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 go. And then that's when they gave out the seniors their awards for participating in basketball. And I hope you guys enjoy this part. With his dad, Vicente, and his mom, Yolanda. Ladies and gentlemen, Christian Orduño. Mario's all the way over here. Mario Alvarez. Mendoza. Jordan Mendoza. 
Kimmy, can you please shut up? No. Each time I ask you if I, if you, each time you ask me to go to the game, do, what do I say? No. Ten, Christian Trevino. From where? You look mad. Christian Trevino. I was mad. He told me I would drag you out of there. Like, who does he think he is? Like, come on, man. Like, it's your boy Legendary. Like, really? Are we going to throw hands here? Uh, anyways, I didn't throw hands, but it kind of, like, brought me down. I went to go talk to the coach, because, obviously, I know... Uh, I could be there, high-fiving the two players, it was dumb. I kind of just kind of beat up the old man, but uh, kind of killed me a little bit, like not even cheer for Grandview anymore, so yeah. Even though he didn't kick me out, I kind of pretty much just got up and left, kind of just killed my whole vibe there, so. No, but all jokes aside, um, it was a pretty good game. I really appreciated seeing all my, my friends there. And uh, real quick, uh, my condolences to the family, uh, Jesse's family. I didn't really know him that well, but if you were like me, you'd get in trouble a lot, and uh, you'd see him a lot. And he's, he always would put on a smile. I mean, I felt like a total criminal, but I mean, he would always be there and you know tell you, get, get your stuff together. I remember I had lunch detention, and he put down a chair and we just that smile, you know, and he just said, you know, get get yourself together. And I just told him, yeah, I will, I will, I will. And uh, another time too, I remember I was skipping class, and I was walking the halls, and I saw him, and uh, he told me, uh, what are you doing? I told him <laughs> skipping class, like I didn't, I don't want to lie to him. And he said, well, you better get to class. And I told him, I will. Just let me do another lap around, you know, the school. <laughs> and he goes, okay, but if I see you again, I'm gonna have to take you to the office and. And he always gave that that smile, always happy, you know. He was he was a great man. Thanks for watching my video.